Most of our empirical knowledge about the universe comes from the analysis of the electromagnetic radiation, the light that we collect with our telescopes. We analyze solar light by using spectrographs, what allows us to measure how intensity varies with wavelength, that is the intensity spectrum. The solar spectrum has thousands of spectral lines produced by the interaction between light photons and the atoms within the solar atmosphere. From the intensity spectrum, we can infer many physical properties of the solar atmospheric plasma, like its temperature and velocity. In order to understand key aspects of the Sun, we need to study the magnetic fields of the solar atmosphere. To this end, we must measure and model the polarization of the spectral line radiation. The light polarization is related to the orientation of the electric field of the electromagnetic wave in the plane perpendicular to its propagation direction. The best known physical mechanism that induces polarization in solar spectral lines is the Seman effect, which is especially useful to study the strong magnetic field of sunspots. However, many key challenges in solar physics lie in the study of the outer atmospheric regions, the chromosphere, the transition region and the corona, where the polarization signals due to the Seman effect are generally too weak. Fortunately, scattering processes become increasingly important in these regions, and they produce linear polarization. Interestingly, there is a physical effect that modifies this linear polarization even in the presence of very weak magnetic fields, that is, the Hall effect. The Polmac project aims at developing novel methods to study the magnetic fields of the outer solar atmosphere by exploiting the polarization signals produced by the scattering of anisotropic radiation and the Hangley and Seman effects in ultraviolet, visible and near-infrared spectral lines. POMAC is of great scientific interest to exploit the unprecedented spectropolarimetric data that the next generation of solar telescopes will provide. Moreover, the POLMAC research motivates the development of space telescopes to observe the polarization of the ultraviolet spectrum, a new diagnostic window of great diagnostic potential. Our theoretical research motivated the development of a series of NASA suborbital rocket experiments called CLASP. These unprecedented ultraviolet spectropolarimetric observations allow us to investigate the magnetism and geometrical complexity of the upper solar chromosphere. We are developing novel radiation transfer codes to model the polarization of the solar spectrum by using the most advanced 3D numerical simulations of the solar atmosphere. We are developing new techniques to obtain information on the elusive magnetic fields of the million degree solar corona. In summary, the scientific objectives we are pursuing thanks to the advanced grant that the European Research Council awarded to me are very ambitious and well beyond the state of the art. We aim at a breakthrough in the development and application of polarized radiation diagnostic methods to make possible the investigation of the magnetism of the outer solar atmosphere via the interpretation of spectropolarimetric observations. 